Sedgwick, owner of Delicious Shoe. Here I am in my fabulous shoe truck that I had outfitted to display all these wonderful styles. I came up with the name Delicious because look at the flavors, the lemon and the green and the red. They're so delicious you almost want to take a bite out of these things. This is my truck. It's 25 and a half feet long and it's filled with delicious shoes like this. This is the first shoe truck in Chicago. I'm surprised actually with the number of food trucks that the word delish was available. Well, it was, so I got it, and there it is. Look at this baby. It's got a fur back and a beautiful gold heel. Higher in the front, lower in the back, very sexy. Almost every style I have, you won't find anywhere else in Chicago. I have about 40 styles, and I'll be getting in about 40 more for fall and winter. This is a wonderful brand that I discovered. It's called Raphael, and it's this little Italian family, and all their shoes are really different. I love the different buckles and zippers on this. Aren't they so cute? Right when you buy a pair of shoes, and you get story. I'm so happy with these. I've gotten such great reactions to the truck. I have a little notebook, and when people say things that are particularly funny, I write them down. I've gotten a woman came in with her boyfriend, and she said, oh my god, honey, I want to die in here. They're very comfortable and the leather is gorgeous. They're beautiful, they're very unique color. I have an advertising art direction background, so um, as a designer I think that influenced some of the really bright colors that I chose and some of the styles. I'm holding a shoe that was made in Italy, it's called Ballerina, it's a bright lemon yellow. I love this shoe, it's super flexible, it's great for travel because you can just smash it up and put it in your bag. It feels like you're wearing a slipper, it's a great shoe. I would say probably 80% of my shoes are from Italy. Some from Spain, Indonesia, Mexico. This is by a company called King Tartufalo, and it's just the softest leather. It's a bright green color. It's a year-round shoe. These are made in Spain, and this has what appears to be a zipper that's been turned inside out on the front. It almost looks like a spine of a fish. They're quite delicious. I love what the Europeans do with their heels. Check out this heel. It's acrylic or plexiglass, but it has this beautiful pattern behind. Looks somewhat conservative in the front, and then it's party in the back. I got my inspiration to do this because of my travels overseas. Anytime I went over to Europe, I was amazed at all the really incredible styles I found just about everywhere I went. Styles that were really different and unique, different colors. Um, the quality of leather was so much better, and I would buy a pair and I'd come home and people would literally stop me on the street and say, oh my God, where did you get those shoes? I heard about this vintage clothing truck in New York City and when I heard that, I thought, okay, that's what I need to do. I need to do a truck so I can take the shoes to the neighborhoods that have people who will enjoy these styles. I do a lot of street fairs. I take it to corporations and do events. I take it to bars and do fundraisers. So I think bridal showers is something I'd like to get into. It will be fun to pull the truck up and have some champagne and try and shoes. And I've just parked on the side of the road in areas like Wicker Park, Andersonville, Bucktown. I do throw home shoe parties. All you need is a minimum of eight women up and it's a very, very fun time. I think they're funky and fun and I want to be different. Oh my God. This is art. I like these. Maybe I can go dancing in this. I also feature jewelry, mostly from local Chicago designers. I sell scarves and accessories. I'll probably venture into handbags. You can reach me at deliciousshoe.com. You can email directly. You can also find me on Twitter, Facebook, Pinterest, and Instagram. What could be better than a whole truckload of really, truly unique shoes? To the delicious, like you just want to eat them up. You want a bite? They're not really edible. Bye now. See you next time at Delicious Shoe.